I think she might know that that's her bark fox. Maybe. Judging from the massive tail wagging, she might have an idea. Should we open it? Okay, let's go open it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Excuse me for looking like a hot mess or something. I literally just walked through the door to change clothes because Riley's birthday park box is finally here and she can't wait one more second. So, no time to fix your hair, mom. No time to look slightly less slutty, mom. I need my park box. <laughs> okay. You guys might remember I did three months of bark box for the holidays for Riley. I got November, December, and January, and then I like to get one for her birthday as well. So if you haven't checked those out, I will link the playlist somewhere in this corner. So yeah, let's get into this guy. All right, the top paper says play ball, and that's adorable. I'm gonna set this on this table over here so that she will not be able to reach it quite so easily. I say that, but she's trying. All right. Oh, this is cute. It says punch me out, hold up card, position dog's face in hole, post a pic with hashtag bark ball. That is so funny. Will you let me do that, Riley? The Barklin Dodgers cap. That is the featured toy. And I will show that to you guys here in a second. I wanna see if she'll let me do this. Can I put this on your face? Come here. Come here. <laughs> nope. Nope, that's not happening. All right. We take the tags off this stuff as we go so she doesn't hurt herself. So the first thing is this Barklin Dodgers. Doggers. Barklin Doggers cap. That is so cute. Does it squeak? Yep. That is a big squeaky. You like that whole thing? That is hard. And this is kind of like a softer part. Look at her. <laughs> Riley likes squeaky toys in case you didn't know. Okay, there you go. There you go. Take your hat. Okay. All right. And that was from just the Bark and Co. company. All right. This says Instincts brand. Trust your instincts. Let's go mutts. Number one in rubbery foam fun. So it's just this big, let's see if I can get these things off. Okay. It's this big foam finger and it's, it doesn't like squeak, it's just squishy. And, I don't know, it's interesting. <laughs> I guess it's got one of those like rubber toys in it from the sound of the thing. I don't know, I've never seen one like that before. Let's see what's next. Okay, goodness, you just can't help yourself. This is says, duck single, Play-Doh pet treats, thinkers, duck, dog treats. Oh, it actually has a Best Buy date, so I mean, this is like, legit, fresh, good for your dog. So that's cool. I, I'm gonna give this to her, because she's not going to calm down otherwise. So that's what this looks like. It's just like a beef jerky stick, and I guess it's duck. Here you go, right here. That will be hidden before this video is over. I'm sure of it. All right. What's next here? Next we have Fruitables Skinny Minis Grilled Bison Flavor. They're soft and chewy dog treats made with real bison. It even has a calorie count. It's two and a half calories. Mini sized dog treats and they're chewy. Sweet potatoes, oatmeal, brown rice, tapioca starch, vegetable, glycerin, bison, potatoes, brown sugar, canola oil. Very natural stuff. I like that. Let's see, the smell of a big thick bison steak grilling over an open flame will get your little carnivore's attention. These skinny minis have that same meaty aroma and taste, but come in our calorie smart format that make them a deliciously healthy option for everyday treating. She loves these little treats. She will do tricks for them all the time. I've taught her how to sit, lay down, roll over, give little high fives. She gets a little confused because she gets so excited about treats. So she like gets ahead of herself and just like freaks out. Sometimes she'll just like 
really spaz and jump in my lap, and it's really funny. But she will love those. I am sure of it. All right. The last thing in here is triple cheese baseball treats. They're from House of Pups. It says grain-free, three cheese flavor dogs love. Fun for all. And it's, again, got very natural ingredients. Ground peas, cheese, tapioca starch, vegetable glycerin, chickpea flour, ground flax seed. It's always very reassuring when your dog's treats have all that stuff in them. What did you do with that thing? I don't know where she hid it, but she put it somewhere. Do you want to try your other treats? Let's try them. All right. And they're so cute, guys. Look at these ones. They're shaped like little baseballs. There you go. It must be good because there are crumbs everywhere that she's cleaning up. So, one more. Ready? One more. Oh, right. Ready? Enemies? Yeah. <laughs> she is so happy right now. Um, her bark box is really late getting here this month. Um, I actually had to email the customer service people for them because it was like, you know, the end of the month and her bark box wasn't here and they actually three day priority shipped it, which I don't think they generally do because generally it takes like about a week or so for it to get here and this one they three dayed and I was having this weird stuff on my account like all month. I ordered it at the beginning of April so that I could get her April box for her birthday and they ship on the 15th of every month and she hadn't gotten her box yet by the time that she normally would have and my account said like I always cancel the renewable subscription part because I just like her to have the one month for her birthday and then the three months for the holidays otherwise she is in treat and toy overload and my house gets taken over but <laughs> she would love it I just you know I like to limit her a little bit right now and uh anyway so her box hadn't shown up yet, and my account had said that it was started April 3rd and did May 3rd. Which I was like, okay, awesome, that's what it should be. And I had a little tracking button there, and every time I clicked on it, it said that my tracking information wasn't available. So I was really confused, and I logged in one day closer to when, you know, it was getting towards the end of when it should have been there. And it said it started April 3rd and did June 3rd. So I checked my bank account to make sure that I hadn't been, you know, charged a second time and I hadn't been for like a May box as well as the April box so I emailed them wanting to know you know what the deal was why I hadn't gotten the April box yet and explaining that it was you know for her birthday and just wanting to know if I was going to get a box in general that I paid for you know whether it be the May or the April I kind of didn't care at that point I just want to make sure that she got a box and uh, the first person I got was just basically double checking my shipping address and stuff so there wasn't a whole lot of help there so I had to type this spiel all over again about the way that everything had happened and the second person told me that they had had some shipping delays and that hopefully her box should be here soon and that if I ended up getting both boxes so be it just keep them I don't know if I'm going to get the second box if I do you guys will know because I will unbox it but they were also nice enough to send her a couple extra toys in the mail which they're not here yet but I will put those on the vlog when they do get here so make sure you keep an eye on my vlog so you can see Riley's other toys but I thought that was really nice of them and that is awesome customer service to make sure that you keep your customers happy even when your customers are mainly dogs because she loves her toys and <laughs> she will just be so excited all the time. Riley, come here. You like your bark box? Come here. Come here. Look. Oh, Eddie. Look up here. There you go. You like your bark box? Hey, look at me. Do you like your bark box? There's a window behind the camera that she is trying to look out because she is under the impression that somebody will be out there, I guess. But there's nobody out there. Do you like your bark box? Yeah? Alright. I'm glad. <laughs> Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I will link BarkBox down below if you guys would like to check it out and get your own subscription. And yeah, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you are not already. And I will see you guys in my next video.